So as many of you know, the Minecraft desert is one of the most desolate and barren places in all of Minecraft. As you can see around me, there's really not many resources and stuff to grab here. So what are we doing today exactly? We're going to try and beat Minecraft, but only in the desert. This entire world you see before you here, it's all just desert. Other biomes, whatever else, no. This is Minecraft, but it's only desert. Also, more than half the people that watch my videos are not actually subscribed. So if you find yourself you're enjoying this video and you check out some of my other videos as well, make sure to subscribe. It's free and it helps me out a ton. And if you find me annoying or something or want to unsubscribe later, you always can. It's completely free and helps support me a lot. So I hope you enjoy today's video. Oh my gosh, how... What the heck? This, <laughs> this is so lucky. We literally spawned next to a ruined nether portal. <laughs> oh, I have all the Christmas chests on. Oh my gosh, this is so lucky though. And we also have a village nearby, oh my god. I literally cannot believe how lucky we got. Like, I'm not even kidding when I say I just loaded up this world and this is the first seed I got. Like, I don't know how you get that lucky, but we did. Hello? Ooh. I don't know why I would ever need cactus, but I kind of just want to take it, because that is, like, me being impulsive. Hello? Okay. Jeez, don't have to be so rude. Okay, I'm not gonna take- I'm not- I'm, I'm putting the cactus away. I'm- I gotta- gotta- gotta get some control. The hardest part, really, of this whole thing is, um, making tools. So as you can see, there is not a lot of trees. By not a lot, I mean, no, there's just none. There's no trees. Like, they don't exist. They're gone. You're probably wondering, how are we gonna get pickaxes and stuff? Oh my gosh, what the heck? There's an- There's another village? What? You're probably wondering about the whole pickaxe thing. And, well, there's a few ways that we could get mining. We obviously can't get any wood here, and as- I don't know if you've noticed, but desert villages don't include any wood planks at all. Not a single one. So the way we're going to do this is we actually have a few ways. We can either find a mine shaft, somehow find stone, or basically the only reasonable option here is so we're going to have to kill our poor iron golem friend. Thankfully enough, we went to the band and nether portal and well, we got an actually really good nether or sword or a decent sword. So that's what we're going to do. And we are going to have to be very careful. I'm going to gather sand and stuff first so he doesn't kill us. Ooh, there's pigs too. That's going to be useful. Okay, watch this. I'm so, wait, what if I burn the iron? I'm so worried. Oh! Okay. I didn't mean to do that. Hello there. I'm not here. Please, don't fail me, Iron Golem. Oh, we're almost... And look, we got it. Okay, so now we have stuff. Or the beginning of stuff. Does fortune work on iron? I've always... No, I want it, right? Okay, this doesn't work at all. Okay. I'm just wondering here, okay? I'm asking the questions. Hello, everyone. I'm here to steal your stuff. This village doesn't have, like, anything. Two thousand years later. Ooh, okay, okay, I'll take it. Got a dead tree. Dead bush. Okay, so another thing we might have a trouble with is food. Although we've got a lot of bread, I'm going to also make sure we can have some cows. I'm breeding them because there will be no new cows spawning, as you can see, because it is, once again, <laughs> only desert. Ah, oh, what you gonna do now? Oh god, they're gonna kill me. What? Okay, okay, um... 
No need to fear, I spawn in the bed of the village. Is this the wrong village? I can't remember. Let's look. Okay, no need to fear, I'm fine, I'm fine. You know, I've got a good idea. I've got, I've, got, I've got a good idea. I think I'm gonna do all the bookshelves, or books, I guess, and sell them. I'll make a bookshelf. Bookshelf. Oh, <laughs> wood. It takes wood to make a bookshelf. Um, yeah, about that. About, about the, about the wood. Yeah. Well, I just came up with the realization. We can't make a shield. Oh, where did I go? Oh, there I am. Because you know what? You know what a shield requires? You know? You know what you need to make a shield? You need wood. So I'm going to head back to the ruined Nether portal and see the current status, sort of, of it. So I honestly do not remember. Well, it looks like we're in luck. I can complete this nether portal and light it when we are ready. I think first I'm gonna try and get a little more iron and stuff. And some a few more resources because, well, I'll be honest with you, I suck. And, well, that would kind of be anticlimactic if as soon as we got to the nether, it just, like, I died, you know? You know? Kind of make me sad. And it would make bad video. I'm a sellout. Ooh. Look what we found. We're actually getting so lucky. This is literally just Minecraft, but we only rely on villages and other structures. Ow, oh, my legs. Ooh, efficiency one. I don't know how or when we would use it, but nice. You know, I don't know how I'm supposed to use the TNT, but I'll take it. So I'm back at the portal now, and I just had a really good idea. You know, there's a, there's been this new nether update, I don't know if you've heard of it, it came out about a year ago. And you know what? There's wood in the nether. So, all our problems really are solved. All the, the stuff we can't get in the overworld, we can probably just get in the nether. If I don't die. <laughs> That's a big if. So well, we've made it through the first part of the journey, and let's just hope our luck continues when we enter the nether. Weird as this may sound, as much as I want to look for the fortress and stuff, really my first objective is to get some wood. So we have found, not a fortress, but a bastion. And I think I'm gonna go take a look. So guys, we did it. We made it to the bastion. Thing is, I don't have any of the things I need to properly get anything out of the bastion. Oh my god. I'm getting murdered. Oh, it's... I'm a fool. 
I just realized what I've done. I'm... The whole thing about these guys is they kind of hate when you open their chests and stuff, you know, and... Well, in case you in case you missed what I just did a second ago, I kind of made a chest and stuff. So I think they might be angry at me. In that case, I'm going to kind of get moving now out of here. You know what this is? This is the sand challenge. This is the desert challenge, which means before I, I'm not even gonna, I'm not even going to play the desert because you know what? It's not the desert. I mean, I'm, therefore I'm not even going to play in the Nether because it's not the desert. So this doesn't count. So you know what? You know what I'm gonna do instead? I'm gonna cover it all in sand. Well, so guys, we did it. The nether is now... Sand. Everything is sand. Sand is everywhere. All of it is sand. Sand is all we need. Guess it's a time to, to walk forward and see where all this sand brings us. Oh. Oh. Can you beat it? Seems possible, but just harder. I'm pretty sure end strike end portals and everything would still spawn so all you'd have to do is go through the nether kill some endermen or get some trades and after that you would you would have everything you need to go to the end and fight the ender dragon would it be easy as regular minecraft no would it be harder as other stuff no make sure to leave a like if you ended up enjoying today's video because i enjoyed making it it was fun i hope you enjoyed i hope you enjoyed a lot also um if you want to continue me to continue this series make sure to leave a comment saying you liked it and stuff and maybe leave a comment on what you'd like to see next. We could try out a different biome that already exists in Minecraft. And maybe we'll even try out some custom biomes. A lot of cool possibilities. And I'm just really excited to see what's possible. Well, the only way for you to see what's possible is to subscribe to the YouTube channel. So make sure you do that. And I'll see you later.